Hi guys, good to see you again. This is part two of the airplane rocket uh, lesson that we were doing last week where you hopefully made a paper airplane. I actually saw a couple of them. Some of you texted them back to me and I'm, I'm so excited that you guys give that a try and they don't have to be exactly the same every time. They're kind of fun, just looking different. Well, today we're gonna add flames to the back of them, but we're also going to look at a book that helps us learn about how planes work. We're saying hello. Hello. This book is called Rocket Science for Babies by Chris Ferry. This is a ball. This ball is moving. Air can't go through the ball. Air goes around the ball. Two balls. Two balls. Change the Life. shape of the ball. Yes. It looks like a wing. And that changes Life. how the air flows around it. Change the angle of it. Tilting up. It deflects the air down. If the air goes down, then the shape goes up. That upward force is called lift. This is the shape of an airplane wing. Can you guys say lift? Can you say lift, Zenny? Can you say lift? Lift. Very good. This ball has no lift. It just bounces. Thank you, red orange. But this wing, it has lift. Yellow. Thank you, babe. This ship is full of fuel. And if the fuel goes out, thank you. The ship goes forward. The faster the fuel goes, the faster the ship goes. So we make it explode. And the forward force is called thrust. Zenny, can you say thrust? Good. And with lift and thrust, we can go to the moon. And now you are a rocket scientist. Woohoo! Now we're gonna make some flames for the back of your airplane slash rocket. This is what will make it a rocket. Just take a regular piece of paper and to make it look like flames, add red and you can scribble it as much as you want. Make it look really, really fiery. Here, Zen, can you help me? Can you help me? I'm adding red. Zen's adding orange. Yeah. I orange. There you go. And yellow, too. Can you add yellow? No. No, not yet. Okay. You can do orange first. Go ahead. She's adding some orange to the flames. That makes it look nice and fiery hot. And I'll put it on the other side too. Yellow. Then ask a grown up to take some scissors and cut it up to the top, but not quite all the way into little fiery strips like that. Then if you crumple it together, and attach it with some tape or some uh, staples to the back of your rocket. Then you have flames. And you can take your rocket with the lift and the thrust. You have to provide that thrust with your own power. 
Did the plane go far? Did the rocket go far, baby? You want to bring it back? Thank you. Do you want to show your pretty blue one? So thanks for joining us for rocket ship science and airplanes. Um, the letter of the week this week is Bye. Z. Z. Bye. <laughs> oh, no. Bye. Hold on. Z for Zoom. And that's what rocket ships do. They zoom. So let's see how this one zooms. Here we go. Shoo. There it goes. You're going to pick it up. Great job. Great Show your beautiful brave. rocket ship. Oh. Can you say Z for zoom? Z for zoom. And Z for? Yay. Yeah. Z for zen. Thank you for joining us. Have a great week.